Ciao Tesla people, I'm back to my favorite spot here in Pescina, charging this time to 100% because I'm traveling back to Florence soon, so I wanted to charge because uh, where I'm staying there is no charger, uh, Pescina is a bit off the highway and uh, I wanted to get to near Rome to do uh, the charge. I'm leaving like uh, oh, maybe in a couple of days or something like that. I need to decide it yet So I'm going to charge here Let me see uh, Which one is seven two four seven uh, two four seven dash one and dash two uh, dash one and Dash two. Oh, dash three. So which one is dash dash two? Well, this up. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. Let me figure out. Yeah. Now it's working. Okay, great. Now it's working. Okay, great. Let's see if it's flashing. Great. Still thinking. Great, green, it's charging. Fantastic. Let's check uh, inside. Um, okay, so I'm at 20%. I'm going to charge you to 100%. Now it's charging 99, 98 to 99 kilowatts here. Uh, will take an hour. Um, so. Just to clarify, so so uh, there, for B charge, there is an app, and there is the RFID uh, card. Um, so you can use that one, you know, by clicking the buttons and that, or in the app there is a map so you select the charger where you're at and you select uh, uh, not only the location but then you select which charger so which actually plug uh, to um, to charge with so there is a number each plug has a number and in the app it shows you the plugs and the number so you select the plug with that number and it becomes from green it becomes blue so that's your plug basically you unplug put in the tesla and you you're off to charging which is good sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't work um if you saw i had a problem with the slide there is a slide to say you know when you select the charger charger number charger uh, plug you swipe to start charging but it looks like sometimes that swap that button uh, doesn't work with that selection I don't know why given sometimes it doesn't work sometimes it gives you error error retry you know all that jazz um, so right now I don't have sentry mode I'm not sure why I think there is no internet here on the on the car which is weird um, anyway I'll get back to you as soon as I'm done I have an hour remaining uh, hopefully I have time to do some breakfast and I'll see you in a bit so I'm uh, up to 98 percent here uh, I charge 61 kilowatts hour and still charging 16 kilowatt five minutes remaining uh, should be even less so on the app you can see the uh, graph the charging curve 
and again it says uh, 63 kilowatts instead they uh, Tesla says 61 so two kilowatts a difference uh, kind of a lot but anyway so I'm almost done and uh, I'm ready to go so uh, hopefully everything is all right again this is doesn't doesn't charge 110 but it charges 9900 so unfortunately this is the second charging station that uh, advertised 110 kilowatts charging but in reality it's less uh, I don't know why uh, and battery is, is full almost 99 get in there and I noticed that uh, during the charging the uh, battery heating went on it's kind of chilly today uh, it says 19 degrees but this is uh, probably at the Sun but uh, in the shadows last probably 16 17 so the preheating went on a couple of times at the beginning and then in the middle and then even around at around 90 percent uh, I guess uh, the charging was slowing down with the energy getting the in the and some preheat uh, which is interesting I didn't know that it would do that of course I cannot preheat the battery because this location is not listed in the uh, navigation when you do the charging um, anyway so so I time is one hour and five minutes which is okay and kilometers added 382 uh, according to this up the B charger up so we are almost done uh, it's nice in Chile out uh, the funny thing is that we went from a couple of days ago went from 36 degrees Celsius to 16 so a 20 degrees um degree and uh, decrease <laughs> in a couple of days which uh totally weird uh and uh, something happened to the car too i'm going to show you in another video there is this warning sign here i'm going to do a video about that and uh, so it's going to be interesting still 99 percent of course at the end uh, it's charging at 12 kilowatts well higher than uh, the AC is charging so at the end it takes a bit uh, longer of course it's just five minutes remaining but it's probably more than five minutes that I'm waiting so uh i think it's almost done come on yeah the app says um, battery heating for optimum performance is doing still which is weird you see in the tesla app there is the heating uh, symbol and here it says uh, what it's doing in charging limited 12 kilowatts of charging and I'm still I added 62 kilowatts done great fantastic so charge is complete okay great so the lock should be done here great and done fantastic so everything went well 
charging is done uh, no problems and that's it anyway so I have my Tesla referral in the description please use it to, to get up to 1000 euro or dollar discount if you buy a Tesla and also have the links for all my uh, accessories that I installed check them out and uh, I have uh, something coming up uh, uh, has a uh, company who wants to sponsor the channel which i'm pretty grateful uh, and happy about it and please subscribe to the channel share it uh, put a like turn on the notification and i'll see you next video ciao tesla people